<coughs> yeah, but you made me laugh and I got coffee all over me. Yeah, we're at a fancy restaurant, now I look like a bum. So, first question, what is the worst thing about Yoon? Yeah, he never turns off the stove, he never closes uh, the, what do you call it? The doors in the kitchen? Yeah. No, he never closes any doors. Sometimes he leaves the fridge open. I'm like, seriously? <laughs> and then towels on the floor. You're not in a hotel. So those are the worst things about me? <laughs> I think that sounds like a catch. Do I get the same question? Yeah. I can never decide anything. Jan is the boss. Is that it? <laughs> well, that's a pretty big thing. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay. More negative things about No, Yanis. let's do positive. Nah, can't come up with one. So it's just you and me left then? Yeah. You know girls, all of a sudden they have to go somewhere, but then I figure that why why not stay for a little longer and just watch it from up here. Chill. Because the view is beautiful. Yeah, I would say it's maybe one of the best views in the world. So we had planned to dedicate the whole day to a couple's Q&A, but then during lunch, all the rest of our company had to leave and we wanted to stay and fly some more so they gave us the keys to a car so we could get home which was pretty nice but we'll get back to the questions here in a little bit yeah girls you know how they are all of a sudden they got to go and do something and yeah and then they disappear but i don't mind i guess you don't mind oh no actually yeah, absolutely McLaren actually has pretty good luggage space compared to the Huracan, which has nothing. Let's go. <laughs> I'm impressed. With what? With your careful driving. Whenever I borrow a car, I drive it like as careful as I can. Because when you borrow cars, you should be highly respectful. I have to say that that was a good little lunch bonus. We should go to lunch more often. So we should. <laughs> Are we rolling now? Yeah. Okay, finally some good sound. I do apologize for those first couple clips. I think they were the worst clips of the video vlog so far, but without a mic and a noisy restaurant, it sucked. But now we're here. So now we're gonna answer more questions. A question first. Do you look into the camera or do you look at Marcus? Camera. Camera. So. How did you and Yanni meet each other? Do you want or should I? No, you can tell the story. I mean, it was all me, so I guess I should tell the story. <laughs> so I'd been in a relationship for eight years and then I'd been single for a few months. And I was finally coming back to Stockholm and I know that they I knew that they had this Thursday dinner where they have all the hottest chicks in Stockholm. So I Ooh. texted the club owner and I'm like, you're going to send me the uh, invite list and I'm going to check out who's coming and I'm going to help you with the seating. So of course I put Yanni next to me. And then I thought I was like the hot, cool guy. I mean, I was like this pro skier and she didn't seem to care at all. So she's like, oh, why don't you have a shot? And I was like, ah, I have a photo shoot tomorrow. She's like, you're boring. So you kept partying. Yeah. And then after a while I, I was like, okay, I gotta get back into it. So I started partying. And then by the time I was ready to be ready to mingle, she left. So I blew it. I partied too much. And then I sent you a, a Facebook message saying, I just looked at the pictures from the other night. Next time I'm gonna do whatever you do. So uh, I hope to see you soon. And then she friend requested me. And that was a big thing for him. Oh yeah, I was really excited. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then a few months later, he told me he never had pictures. Yeah, it was just a way to start talking. Of course there's no pictures. I just had to come up with a way to say something. That was cute. Yeah, well, I had to try. You like, could have asked, like, how are you? 
I would still have answered. Yeah, my game isn't that good, so I'm sorry. <laughs> But then, it, to, to tie up everything, uh, I was in Austria a couple of weeks later, and then a friend of mine called me. He's like, oh, we're going out in Stockholm tonight, and uh, I'm going to try to pick up Yanni tonight. I'm like, no, not Yanni. Like, I put, set my eyes on her. He's like, no, no, I'm going to do it. So I'm like trying to figure out, I'm still in Austria. I'm trying to figure out whether Yanni's going home or not, or going out. And then I think at 7, p no, 6 p.m., I find out that she is going out. So at 7 p.m. I am on a flight from Innsbruck via like multiple cities in Europe, land at 1 a.m. in Stockholm to make sure that my friend doesn't get to her. And ever since then it was us. Yeah, here we are. So good thing I'm crazy enough to fly around. Yeah. So I guess that's, that's the story on how we met. Yeah. And that was now... Four and a half years ago. And now she finally moved in here to Monaco. Yeah, finally. How? Two, three months? Four months? Uh, two months. Two months. First time I ever really I lived with a girl. Months. Yeah, it's gone quick. Yeah. So now we're living together and everything, and uh, I guess we can continue with another question that I saw. When is Mini, you or Yanni coming? Should I answer or you? You're the boss. I mean, I don't know yet. Not now. But maybe in like two years? Two years? Maybe. See, I, I mean, now I just moved here, so now it feels like we took a big step, and then um, still waiting. So maybe after that, a ring. <laughs> she wants a ring. No, I didn't say that. I spent all my money on cars. I don't. <laughs> know, I can't afford a ring. <laughs> no, but first we move in together, and then maybe get married, and then have kids. And my plan is to just keep doing what I'm doing until she says that she wants a baby, and then we'll figure it out. Yeah, but when do you want a baby? No, I don't plan much. Tomorrow? <laughs> Two, three years? It takes nine months, you know. Yeah, we should start At practicing. <laughs> you have me, guys. <laughs> exactly, we have Marcus. Yeah, we ado let, let's adopt Marcus instead. <laughs> That'd be better. Family. Is Yamid into cars as much as you are? No. Small cars. Mini cars. Cute cars. She, like, does not get impressed by Lambos whatsoever. I mean, they're cool, of course. You think so? Yeah, I mean, they're cool, but... It's not like I would like to drive around in it every day. Let's just say that I think it's a good thing that a girl does not get impressed by Lambos. Even though I love Lambos, I think it's a sign of a good girl type girl if they don't really care about flashy things. Yeah. I appreciate that, even though I wish she was a bit impressed. <laughs> in the beginning, you wished. Yeah, I was trying so hard. She didn't care. <laughs> How many days do you spend together with the Yami in a year? Hmm. I don't know. It's, it depends. What year it is? <laughs> well, if we just calculate an average, I would say 150, 200. Now it's gonna be more probably. Yeah, now I don't know what's gonna happen. But nice. before it was, I would say, yeah, 200. Yeah. It's a lot of traveling. Yeah, we usually see each other at least every month, like a week. Yeah, but then you have when I go to New Zealand, Australia. And yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. So sometimes it's like five, yeah, six, Yeah, but then every weeks. summer we spend two months together. So we make up for it. So we've actually only been dating for like two years. How old are you, Yanni? I am 21. <laughs> I'm 26. What are the things you argue most about? Photos. A 100% when we're shooting photos for Yanni's blog. Always. Yep. Because one moment, it's not that important and it doesn't matter. But on the other hand, I can't say let's do this. So I just don't get it. I will explain my side another day. No, explain it now. I want to know. Okay. Sometimes I just want to take a quick, easy picture like against the wall. But then can, you can say like, no, it's too boring. Let's do this. Let's do this. And if I'm tired and I just want to have a picture, then yeah, we start fighting. But we're not fighting. We're more arguing. And I get like, ah, whatever, do your picture. And I get super angry. Here I am like trying to be super nice and help out and then yeah i know they always turn out great so yeah i get really bummed out <laughs> yeah I, mean, I love you too okay. but, but maybe not all the time when we're shooting no but then um yeah but we have never actually had a proper fight no right no and i haven't i've seen yanni cry once and i can't even remember what it was for i guess i was falling so yeah next question you don't you and marcus have 
fucking Formula One. No, it's just the Ferrari. Oh, I was about to say Ferrari. <laughs> yeah, you know your car sounds. Yes. When you live here, you become an expert in car sounds. Oh, that's an Aventador with an IPE exhaust. Oh, that's a Fiat 500. No, you can't hear those. <laughs> Okay, so next question. Yoon, don't you and Marcus ever feel like you need some alone time because you're doing so many things together? <laughs> yeah, wonder- I, thought you, I thought the question was alone time together without me. <laughs> no, but that's, that's what I don't know. Is the, is the question alone time without Yanni or alone time apart from each apart other? Apart from each other, of course. I think it's apart from each other. Yeah. Well, yeah, it has to be. So far, we've been so into what we're doing that it hasn't, uh, we ha- it hasn't crossed our minds. <laughs> Do you feel like you need some alone time for me then? No. No. Except for when after we have done some photo shoots. Okay. Then I need alone time with Marcus. But I, I don't know, Marcus. <laughs> what, what do you think, Marcus? No, I think we're doing fine. Yeah, we're I've, so. Oh, you've been together for forty-five days. That's more than we've ever been. Together. Forty-five days straight, day and but night. What is it? How many? Uh, it's like forty. Or something. Yeah. Uh, 43 days straight, every meal together, every flight, every room. But no, we, we are totally okay so far, but I, I guess I'm going to go to Norway next week and then we're going to have a week apart. We're taking a break. Oh not not from video blogging, but from, uh, from us as a couple. Are you going to make it? Yeah, we're going to make it. I'm going to keep... I, I've been practicing my premiere. You can call Skype. Yeah, he's probably going to come up because <laughs> I'm going close to where Marcus, Marcus lives. I miss you. No, but we're doing good so far. We're pretty easy people. Yeah. Does Yanni ever want to come out to your project, such as Norway? Yeah. I've done Gumball. Come on. <laughs> yeah, but Gumball is Gumball. That's fancy cities and stuff. Like. That's what? Fancy cities and stuff. Norway is more like ski places and... Yeah, I've been to Norway with you. Once. Yeah, my conclusion is that she will go anywhere, mm-hmm. camping, tenting, or old cabin, or whatever, but not for too long. What is your favorite TV show to watch together? Gossip Girl. Yeah, well, since Gossip Girl has been running on the TV for the last week straight... Maybe it's my favorite. I like it too. Yeah. I'm not afraid. But that's not our favorite. What is our favorite? What do we watch the most? I think the best one is... I'm, I have to say 24. 24. 24 is maybe the best TV show ever made. Yeah. And we, I love to watch TV shows. Like, that's the highlight of my day because my brain goes like this all the time. So every night I try to watch a couple episodes to slow down. So I'm like, Yanni, stop working. Come like chill for a second. No, but for me, I like to have it in the background when I work. It's the best. And for me, I can't do two things at the same time. So oh. I have to focus 100% on the TV show. And also, what do you think about re-watching TV series? I love it. Because then you know, so you don't have to focus too much. Yeah, and Marcus is laughing because my memory is so bad that if I watch something after two years, <laughs> you forget I don't know what's going to happen. I just watched... Uh, Gossip Girls. He's no, what, what was that movie I watched? <laughs> I Am Legend. I Am Legend. I was so excited to watch it because I watched it two years ago and I, I had no idea what was going to happen. That's so nice. It, no, it's not nice. You're like I, the fish in uh, Finding Nemo. Pretty much. Like, <laughs> there's so much info coming in that I can't handle it. So it's like, and then gone. Yeah. Are Next you guys time. still vegetarians? Yes. And I, no. I, I'm not, but I, how much more yeah, vegetables? Yeah, I was so impressed. Like, you did it for a, half, a month and a half, and I was, I didn't even think you would make a week. No, it was easy, but uh, there was way too much cheese fondue and pasta. <laughs> but now, how much more vegetables do I eat compared yeah, to before well, that? It's, it was really good for you. But I, I'm still on it. I don't eat fish, meat, or chicken. So, I'm still a vegetarian, and I like it. How many questions do we need to do? Uh, a question for you, Yanni. Yeah. What kind of music do you like? I, I can know, say I her do... two favorite things. I've done gumbo with her when she is a DJ. And it is mostly Justin Bieber. No. And Just Kygo. when he releases... Oh, Kygo, I like. But I like everything. You like, like, happy party music. Yeah, happy party music. Do you like skiing together? Yeah, because then I can go fast. Yeah, I like skiing with Yanni on uh, Piste, because she loves to go fast. But in powder, she gets real angry. Yeah. I don't like powder. We went to Japan together and I'm like, isn't this a heaven? And she was just mad. Tell the story. Well, you I, pushed I, me out and yeah. hill like this. And I've never done powder skiing before. Well, so I did like a backflip because I... <laughs> yeah, and you were stuck. fine, right? Yeah. Getting deep in the snow is just part of it. So maybe I was a bad teacher. But we had fun skiing. Are we going to give it another try to Japan this winter? 
Yeah, but I'm gonna go with another teacher. What if I promise to be a good teacher? We'll see about that. While being a teen, what was your dream job? My dream? I wanted to be a police. And then a lawyer. I didn't really have a dream. I just wanted to be the best skier in the world. I didn't think. I was just like, what? I'm gonna be a great skier. I wanted to be a police on a horse and then it changed to a police. <laughs> and then I wanted to be a lawyer because my dad said, I'm so good at, <laughs> what do you say, defending yourself. So you should be a, a lawyer. Yanni can turn anything. Yes. Anything. So maybe I'll be a lawyer in the future, we'll see. So, I guess that's it. Yeah, did we answer pretty much everything? Was it a good Q&A? Yeah. Did you get to know Yoon and Yanid? One thing. My name is not Yanid. It's just my Instagram name. <laughs> my real name is Yanni, Without the D, because that's my surname. Starting with a D. Yanni. So now when we got that straight, we'll call it a day and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Ciao! And check out Yanni's YouTube, YouTube. channel so that she shoots more videos as well. Yeah. Click link up here.